Well, howdy, fellas. Just wanted to do a quick little first impression video. Um, this is the kit I'm using. SMB, very good filters. I have nothing but good things to say about it. For the money, you get pretty good stuff. Um, I haven't compared anything, but wild guess. If you want something marginally better, you could try Banks. But um, my personal choice is SMB. It's just a good, solid middle. They don't rip you off or give you some bunch of crap. Anyways, my initial video, I came here to put this plug back on. Um, I have this installed for 500 miles. Uh, that, the kit gives you the spacers for those sensors, the tube. Make sure you got those spacers. You don't have any check engine lights, the box, and the filter. It's more or less a, oh, a little grommet here. Let me show you the odometer. Hey guys, let me know what you think about this new camera. I prefer my old one, but for you guys, you guys enjoy this one. 33690. Obviously, it's picking up the odometer a lot better. <laughs> the old one did but anyways though um, yes this truck's all stock despite all the other videos you guys have seen right now the only custom aftermarket thing on this truck in the performance aspect uh is this you know and the appearance obviously we got suspension we got different different shocks springs but that's a video for another time um i'm a die hard dry filter dude so that's just one of those guys i don't i don't care for the oiled filters at all now my first impression under light throttle on a cold engine it bucks in a way or stutters whatever you want to call it there's the funny thing is it's just it's just a little well it's quite noticeable there's just a little bit of bucking going on cold engine light throttle no check engine lights as soon as it warms up it does just fine it even gives you better low end power and what i mean even like this engine's very impressive on low end power i got zero complaints about that fuel efficiency sucks on these engines compared to the ford gens but that's a topic for another day something about this intake i strongly believe that the old system just didn't have enough volume going through it um okay i'll talk about it so this turbo is pretty much a four gen turbo with bigger props so they just made the old turbo push a little bit more volume and then they kept the same intake filter which was a really draw for like a drawback for me i'm like what are you guys doing we need more air so that's why i was really excited to put this intake and I've, I've said before that hey this box if someone comes up just replacing the box i'm fine i was fine with even the piping but these guys gave you a new piping so that piping is pretty no, it's a good system. I have nothing but good things to say about it. It's an easy install, no big deal. So with this plug installed, like it's gonna be back installed after this video, you can't really hear the boost. You can't hear the turbo. You can hear slightly the exhaust break. With the plug off, like so, you could hear the boost. This sounds phenomenal, it sounds very, it's not overly done. It's not annoying, but it sounds phenomenally. For me, because of that light throttle, I wanna go back to testing on cold throttle or cold engine very light throttle so you feel do it with a plug so i could come back with my second video after thousands of miles and vouch for xyz and what it actually does and what it doesn't do and tell you for sure i'm also testing gas mileage i want to say it'll give him better gas mileage but i can't i can't say it and the reason i'm i'm pretty sure about it because under light throttle i could boost quicker so that tells me it's more efficient Where'd my kids go? They were driving the Ram truck around here somewhere. No, oh, they're off-roading or pulling rocks, whatever they're doing. Oh, so yeah, um, with a few more, at least a couple thousand miles down the road, I'll, I'll keep you updated. I'm really hoping for at least a mile to the gallon better, but I'll let you know. I need a voucher. I need a test. I need to do three tests, and I, all three of them need to show me better gas mileage. But as I was saying, lighter throttle, even more low-end power. The, the turbo could spool it better. I mean, it's definitely a, a performance increase of about 10% low and mid seems to be the same possibly a little bit of high-end understanding mechanics i want to say there's high-end improvements but i don't want to jump to a conclusion but on low and i can tell you for sure you got a, about i'm talking like from 900 rpm to about 1500 you got more power with this thing it just pulls up lights up the turbo easier so that's my thing i think if this was uh letting them breathe boys kind of situation um it would we, we would benefit a lot more and uh we'll see how that goes Anyhow, meanwhile, I'm just running a stock setup, despite the other videos you guys have seen. Um, there's, there's, a, there's a good cause for it running stock. Anyways, um, just a little sneak peek. I figured out the transmission decently. I, I'm figuring out the engine pretty good. So that's why I went back to stock, back to basics. Uh, you know, I erased all the possibilities of issues here and there, maybe everywhere. Um, back from the core 
and I'm figuring a lot out. I'm very excited to share it with y'all. But before I can prove to myself, you know, three tests of some sort of power, efficiency, and the whole transmission. Uh, so I'm, al I'm always a thing of three, like I told you, the gas mileage. I want to see three tests have improved. Um, so I'll keep you all updated. I got a lot on my plate. It's an excuse in a lot of cases. I know I could push harder and keep you guys better informed about these engines, but it is what it is. I'd much rather take it easy and, uh, or take it slower and give you guys proper information and proper uh, info on these trucks than uh, jump. Let Some of you guys watch my videos, and based off my videos, I've got these emails, I've got these messages. Hey, man, thanks to you, I bought XYZ, and it's like, well, I hope I didn't mislead you. <laughs> I really hope I never mislead anyone. I have zero intentions in doing so. These videos are always to help everyone. And if I'm helpful, God bless you. That's all it's all about. Yes, I'm building a brand for myself and I'm building a channel. But most importantly, this channel was built to help people. You know, the, the wealthy say you help enough people, um, they'll come back around to you kind of deal. Anyways, as always, boys, I'm going to install this back in and expect another video about this SMB here shortly. As always, may the Lord bless you and may the Almighty find a Ciao. Bye.